Hello, I'm Natalie Lutz and this is your Daily Barometer News Blast for Wednesday, January 31st. ASOSU graduate representative Andrew Oswald appeared via webcam for his arraignment at Benton County Courthouse. We had Tiffany Smith at the courthouse today to get more information. Today in the Benton County Courthouse, ASOSU graduate representative Andrew Oswald was arraigned on two counts of first degree intimidation and two counts of criminal mischief in the, in the third degree. At the arraignment, Oswald, who appeared via webcam, requested a court-ordered attorney. The case will reconvene tomorrow to determine eligibility for Oswald's attorney. Uh, further updates on this story will be provided by the barrel as information is readily available. Chief Deputy District Attorney Ryan Jostrom requested that on behalf of the state of Oregon that Oswald's security amount be increased to $250,000. Additionally, Jostrom requested conditions regarding Oswald's case if he is released from custody. Conditions include that he is not to make any contact with name witnesses or the victims of the case, as well as the group showing up for racial justice. Jocelyn also requested that Oswald is prohibited from the Oregon State University campus. Jocelyn informed the court that four firearms were found at Oswald's residence. It was also requested from the state of Oregon that all firearms in Oswald's possession will be turned over to law enforcement. All requests were granted by the presiding senior judge, Carol R. Bisham. The barometer will continue to provide further coverage as more information becomes available. For complete stories from today's news blasts, you can visit our website at orangemedianetwork.com. Don't forget to follow us on social media and make sure to pick up this week's issue of the barometer on newsstands around campus. From all of us here at Orange Media Network, I'm Natalie Lutz and thank you for tuning in.